Hey everyone, this is Peter from F2 Pool, and today we're going to be taking a look at how to mine Dogecoin. So firstly, you're going to want to go to the f2pool.com homepage and log into your account. And then you can go to the top right and select account settings. So from this page, we're going to want to select the appropriate sub account and then select the coin that we'd like to add our payout address to. So in this case, we're adding a Litecoin address. And from here, we can basically add a payout address from any wallet address provider that we'd like, whether that be a large exchange like Binance or a hardware wallet like a, tre a Trezor. So anyways, without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and add the appropriate payout address. And here we go. Copy and paste that in there. And then I can label which exchange it's from. And then in this case, we can choose to sync our Litecoin payout address with our other mining accounts. For the purposes of this demonstration, I will include that. And then we're gonna to want to enter our two-factor authentication code. So, here we go. All right, so last step is we're actually gonna to wanna to go to our email and confirm the change. So I'm gonna go click on the link that uh, I got via email. And as you can see here, the change is complete. So we can just go click go home and there we go. But the process isn't entirely complete because uh, as you are aware, this is about how to mine Doge. So why are we mining Litecoin? Well, the only way to actually mine Dogecoin is by merge mining it with Litecoin because they both use the same uh, mining algorithm. So anyways, let's go ahead and do the same process again. We're gonna wanna add a Doge address, either from an exchange or a Doge wallet, or however you'd like, as long as it's actually a Doge address. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the appropriate address. And there's the wallet source. And then in this case, for the purposes of this demonstration, we will not select this option. And then we'll enter our two-factor authentication code. All right, last step, we're gonna to wanna to check our email and confirm the change. And as you can see, the process is complete. I do want to note, however, that after the process is complete, your account's payout features will be suspended for three days for security reasons if you add a payout address within the first seven days of creating an account. Before the suspension ends, your revenue will be credited into your account balance. You can view the date of when payouts resume on the payout settings page. And to further enhance account security, after adding or changing a payout address on the mining accounts that are older than seven days, payouts will be frozen for three days. Revenue during those three days will accumulate in your balance for the future payout. Thank you so much for tuning in. Hopefully that helped. And again, this is Peter from F2 Pool. Peace out.